Hi, my name is Russell Brack. I am an Embedded System Specialist here at the System Design Center at Future Electronics. Today, I would like to show you the Maple Candy. The Maple Candy was designed here at the SDC. It's a Renesas promotion board with a bunch of Renesas chips on it. We've got an RL78, that's the processor. We've got a BLE module. We've got a couple of PMIX and a couple of op amps. Uh, we're going to show you some demos that we have set up for this. All right, so here we have the Maple Candy and the Maple Candy app. We're going to turn on the Maple Candy. Maple Candy found. All right, <clears throat> so we are going to show you five demos. The first one is going to be the moisture sensor. All right, so the moisture sensor is built very simply. It's just a, a BJT with an op amp. All it does is take the voltage between the two probes. With it open, it reads 3.3 volts. When you put your hand on, you see the voltage drops. If you were to short them, you'd get almost zero. So that's the first demo. Okay, so here we have a loopback for the ADC and the DAC. Right now, the DAC is outputting zero volts and the ADC is reading zero volts, which is good. We up the DAC and the ADC reads in the right voltage. Uh, by the way, this is for the 3.3 volt. Now we have the same demo, but this is for zero to 10 volts. So we switch to channel one reading zero volts, outputting zero volts, outputting 4. Point, uh, putting 4.8 volts, reading in 4.78 volts. That's pretty close. Goes all the way up to 10, reading 9.99, and all the way back down. All right, for all of you, uh, all of you with industrial clients, here's a four to 20 milliamp in. As you can see, it reads four milliamps, goes up, all the way to 20 milliamps. And last but not least, we have implemented a very basic metal detector you can see here, there's nothing on this LED, which means it's not reading any metal. You put some metal into the detector that we've built ourselves, and the light goes on. So yes, that's the Maple Candy board. It was built as a development platform. Uh, for more information about the board, contact your local future rep or go to futureelectronics.com. And uh, thank you for watching.